that? Max. Oh, is it you, Max? Did you draw that? Oh, hello, Max. Uh, welcome. Oh, are you going somewhere today? No, 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 no. Hi, this is uh, Mrs. Yoon from J Art Studio. Today, we're going to study about the positive and negative space. Space is one of the basic elements of art. Okay, it represents the distance between the area around uh, within the space, form, color, and lines. Space can be a positive and negative. And it includes a background, foreground, and middle ground. Both positive and negative space can be play important role in the overall success of a, a work of art, right? So today we're gonna draw um, the where is gonna be a positive and where is gonna be a negative. Now, as you see the still life setup of a shoes, and we're gonna indicate the where uh, we're gonna paint the black. As you see the pot. Um, it's a gray color, but we're gonna paint it black, okay? Because uh, um, the table is gonna be white, obviously. So the pot has to be black, and the shoe has to be black. So then, how we wanna indicate the in between? We don't wanna make the images stuck together. So we're gonna indicate the little gap. That's gonna be a white, okay? So the shoe will be black, and the white area uh, table and then okay now black. we're gonna paint it with a black acrylic paint make sure you don't put too much water we're gonna make it opaque and uh, we're gonna paint the positive space first make sure give a, a good equal amount of uh, both negative and positive uh, so that considered uh, by many uh, to be a good design or work of art Okay, so make sure you paint it with a very thin uh, brush. Flat brush is also good. And make sure you use a small amount of paint. So thin the brush down, make it very sharp and narrow and get onto the detail areas.
Well, it's uh, almost done. Uh, I hope everybody enjoy watching and uh, also you can try it out at home and you just need a one color to make a great work of art. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye bye. JR Studio now offering the online classes and then shipping out our package. Anyone who's interested from USA, you can email to us jrstudio at gmail.com